Welcome to my vlog. I know I haven't done vlogging for like a really long time, but now I'm vlogging again because I wanted to. So I'm vlogging. <laughs> and today we're gonna be unboxing a package. Here it is. It's yarns for my crocheting and it just came today. I'm kind of really excited. So it's really big too. It's like, it's like that big, pretty big. And you're gonna be watching me unbox it today. So, yeah. Okay, please don't mind the messy background. Because, like, I know it's messy, okay? I just don't want to clean it. I mean, no, not like that. Okay, that came out the wrong way. I mean, it's just messy like that. It's always gonna be like that. So, might as well just accept it as it is. <laughs> okay, so let's get to the unboxing part. Alright, so let's unbox it but before we do we have to spray it with alcohol first because why not <laughs> i'm joking okay so here's my alcohol and there we go now we need to get our scissors to cut it open oh my gosh i hope i do not cut the yarn that would be so terrible like, okay, I'm not gonna cut it. I'm just gonna rip it open. Wow, that's so neat. <laughs> yeah, I just threw it back there. Don't mind it. Here it is! Oh my god, I'm so excited. They're so big. I didn't think it would be this big. So, let's spray it with some alcohol again. There we go. So, um, this is milk cotton yarn. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's open it. How do I? Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh, this tape is so hard to get off. Okay, there we go. Ah! Okay. Oh my god, it's so thick. Okay. So the colors I got I got is this like navy blue color. It's like indigo blue. Yeah. So we got that. And then I got these two colors. It's a light brown kind of color. And this beige color i plan to make a bear with these and i got two whites why two because i always seem to run out of white like i swear i thought i had a small piece of white left but i guess i ran out of white so much that it's gone it's also gone <laughs> so yeah um i also got this like really cute light blue it's like so pretty i like this i love this color you know and the white is so clean like, it's milk cotton oh my gosh you can't read that can you yeah i'm sorry it's milk cotton yarn so light blue this yellow color i still have yellow but i don't think it's the same shade because like it's a different yarn you know and this light pink this is actually really cute i didn't expect for it to like be this shade of pink but it's cute anyways and this fern green yeah i think that's the name fern green it's also really cute and really soft too these yarns are so soft and okay for our last two colors we have red oh my god that's so bright red and black so i got a total of 11 
yarns. Mm. These are also bigger than I thought it would. Like, I know it said like it's like 50 grams, but I didn't expect this much. It's bigger than it looks, okay? Like, compared to my old yarns that I use. Look at that. Look at that. Like, the size difference is so... Oh my gosh. I'm definitely gonna get these yarns more often because... Oh my gosh, I love it. I, I think this is also milk cotton. Like... Um, don't mind me for not knowing because someone just gave this milk cotton yarn to me, so. I mean, this yarn to me. So I'm not really sure if it's milk cotton or not, but it's a really good yarn. And this is what I made with it, if I can find it. Oh yeah, here it is. I made a drawstring pouch with it, like, you can tie it close, then you just like, excuse me. Oh my gosh wait it's still tied my bad okay so you can tie it close and then you can like open it then you can just put stuff in it because like it's a drawstring pouch oh my gosh excuse me all right so here are all the yarns i can't hold them all okay but I'm really happy with the white ones because, like, I think the beige, no. Okay, the white one is definitely the heaviest. And thickest, too. Um, so, this is um five-ply milk cotton yarn. They're 50 grams each, so, Yeah. And if I can, I will show you how I organize them and where I organize them. Like, where I keep them. Like, where I keep my yarns. So, let's go do that. Okay, so, like, this tower is where I put my stuff. Like, these are, like, my projects. Please don't mind that. I kind of added way too many rows for that. Um, these are my hooks right there and my scissors and stuff. Those are my yarn scraps, like in that tiny basket right there. And these are yarn, you know, I kind of ran out of place to put them. And here are my yarns, like the rest of my yarns. The yarns I got first, and by the way, those are way tinier from these new yarns that I got. Oh my gosh, it's so shaky. Please don't mind me. I'm kind of recording with my iPad and I'm only using one hand to hold it. So you kind of got to work with this, you know? So let's go put these new yarns in there. Okay, so I just realized that the yarns won't all fit into that tiny one row at the bottom. So I moved some stuff, like I adjusted some stuff. Like, you know how my tools like my hooks and stuff used to be here on like the second row so i moved them up and then i also moved my project up because the stuff at the top were kind of like just some random stuff i needed the place to put um no i mean like the stuff at the top were like just some stuff that were like had no place on my table so i just put them up there so now we can fit my yarns here on the second row I think they will fit. Hopefully they will because I do not know where else to put them if they do not fit. So we are going to start with the indigo one. Then the black one. Okay, I don't think I need to say every color, right? Yeah. We're just going to make them fit up here. Oh my gosh. Okay, so like only eight fits there. So I think we're gonna put the rest here at the bottom. I know you guys won't see this, so I hope you guys see that. Yeah, I think I think it's pretty much visible. Okay, 
just like that and that's that was me organizing my yarns i kind of want to order more yarn now even though i just got these new ones i still want to order more maybe next time though so yeah so thank you for watching that was me like organizing my yarns and unboxing them so um yeah thanks for watching hopefully i will be making more videos in the future um bye